Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Kai Icewilder, that is me. <laughs> and in today's video we are back in Test Realm for another Test Realm video. Today we are actually finally going to be trying out one of the new fights that was added into Wizard 101. Uh, they actually added two brand new Skeleton Key bosses. One of them is in Grizzleheim, which is here. Uh, we're actually going to be doing that one today. And the other one is in Caramel, which is in the Nibelheim Mines. That is going to be like a giant marshmallow. I'll probably do a vid video on that one as well. But uh, this one is in the Savarestad Pass. <laughs> I think I said that right, but if not, you know. Um, so as you guys saw, I'm going to actually get off the the boss room, or I guess the entrance is right there, as you can see. Um, it's right under the waterfall, so it would be in about this area on the map. Um, pretty much what we're going to do today is we're, we're either going to fight the wood or stone. I'm not sure if I want to go for the gold, because I'll be by myself. Um, I don't have a group with me, um, but I do recommend uh, using a group with you. Oh boy. I mean, to be fair, I could do it with some of these guys. Um, but we're, we probably won't. So uh, one thing I do want to say is if you can jump into Test Room right now and do this uh, you're, and you don't have any skeleton keys, uh, there actually was something that Decius added into the Crown Shop for you guys. So you can go into the Crown Shop, go to Featured, and right right here, right, <laughs> right here, it's a hot item, uh, you can actually get the skeleton key bundle. You get one wood key, one stone key, and one gold key, all for one single crown. So I think that's really cool. I'm glad they added that. Um, in case you didn't have anything so uh, I actually bought I think about three of them so in case I die or in case I want to try something new I can actually do that and of course I will be using those also for the caramel battle uh, what I want to go over in this video pretty much which is why I'll be doing a lower tier uh, for this video is I, I believe all of the cheats for this boss are about the same we're actually gonna go we're gonna go ahead and start loading up in um, I'm gonna go ahead and set up my deck probably and I'll skip to like when I you know actually go into the fight but uh, let's go ahead and go over the cheats so for all of them all the cheats are the same uh, for the wooden uh, skeleton key the gold and the um, so the stone wood and gold uh, they're all the same cheats uh, there is actually uh, a new boss that is in there named King Boar and his companion named Grendelin so uh, Grendelin is actually an ice elite um, uh, monster, which is pretty cool, and then you also have the the boss, uh, which is uh, King Boar. It is a myth boss, uh, so uh, you gotta be aware of both of them. They're both they're all they're both pretty powerful. Um, I'm gonna go over a little bit about both of them before we even get into the fight, just so that you guys will be prepared. So the first thing that'll happen as soon as you actually join this fight. Um, Grendelin will actually interrupt everything with a shadow spell called Shadow Sentinel, <laughs> and it will intercept 75% of the damage uh, dealt to King Boar. Uh, but the strategy is, if you try to kill Grendelin first, uh, Grendelin actually comes right back, and then the cheat happens all over again. So the first thing that you actually have to do is to actually kill King Boar. Um, a, a, a little cheat that people have already found around this cheat is you use Beguile on Grendelin before you hit. So as soon as you're about to hit, use uh, the Beguile, which is a death spell. Um, it'll kind of bring uh, Grendelin onto your side and then it will pretty much take off that 75% 70, uh, interception uh, right before you hit. So I think that's really cool. Um, another cheat is you cannot faint uh, King Boar without an indemnity. Uh, if you do, he will cast a mass uh, cleanse ward um, on the faint. So the first thing that you actually want to do as soon as you start the battle, if you can, is to use an indemnity faint and then you can start trapping away and you're good to go. But other than that, you can blade, you can use any other trap, um, you, you can use auras, you can do anything else. Uh, this is a pretty average uh, boss battle. So next we're going to go over the rewards, which I think is amazing. Uh, I want to say I'm so glad that Wizard 101 is adding uh, stuff like this into their game. Uh, so pretty much the rewards are the pretty much the entire Grizzleheim lore pack. So all of the gear, um, of course, that's when these spells were added, which we'll get to that in a minute. Um, pets, all of those things are added into these the rewards, which I think is amazing. Um, another thing is forget going to Lore Master if you're trying to learn these spells, um, because you can actually get the spellments from these fights and a lot of people have already said that and they've confirmed that you can get quite a few spellments from these fights uh, so if you guys are trying to get any of these spells uh, which are Rodotusker's Spin I think that's how you say it uh, Hammer of Thor 
and Grendel's uh, amends. All those spells, which I'll put up when I when I mention them, all of these spells um, you get spellments for from from you get drops from this from the boss battle, uh, which is really cool. Um, and it's actually a really easy way to get these spells trained for your character, which I really like. Uh, and yeah, um, but that is pretty much the entire fight. Next thing I'm going to do is uh, go ahead and get my, my deck all set up for, the, for this boss. And I think we're going to go ahead and go for a, a battle. All right, we're going to go for the stone key boss and hopefully everything will work out just fine. All right, uh, let's unlock this door and get ourselves in here. Oh man, listening to the Grizzleheim music, it's, it's just amazing. All right, so there's Gwendolyn. And there is King Boar. All right, rank 12 and rank 11. Uh, obviously, these this is the stone key boss, so don't think of anything too crazy. Uh, there is still quite a lot that's going to be happening. I hope we're first. Perfect, we are first. So we're going to do that, that, and that. Perfect. Um, I wish I could have... Well, I don't, I'm not sure. I want to... Um, I wish I could... Oh. oh, there we go. You are my shield. Oh, boy. So that would be the uh, intercepted uh, of 75% of the damage. That's quite a lot, man. That's quite a lot. Uh, keep in mind, if we were to kill Grendelin first... Alright, there's the stun. I actually did bring some stun blocks, so I guess we're not going to have to deal with that uh, next turn. But uh, I want to see... It. Oh, yeah, this guy actually does have Earthquake. That is, uh, that is pretty important to know. Um, I am stunned. So I'm going to... Hmm. I want to say I want to keep that, but eh, let's get rid of that just so that we get um, another uh, card next turn. Because like I said, I want to get myself the Indemnity Trap on him. Oh, we crit! In case you guys didn't know, by the way, uh, critical, critical block, uh, the damage, all of that has been changed in a way. So of course, I'm going to probably be putting... The oh man, there's another here. Let's mm, we don't need another stun block. All right, let's start putting um some blades on. I'm getting kind of nervous. I don't want to get you know I don't want to get earthquake because this guy does have earthquake, which is kind of spooky, kind of scary. Don't like that. Okay, there we go. I got a plus forty five. There's the tower shield. Oh, I also did bring uh, Shrike, my Shadow Shrike, just so I can negate some damage, you know. Um, and of course I did bring a Convert for uh, that guy right there. Let's just uh, go ahead and put the shield on so we can negate some more damage. Okay. Got a weakness, oh man. <laughs> ah. mm, let's get rid of that. Put this on. I feel like this fight could possibly be a while. I'm getting nervous. Alright. Oh, a uh, uh, fizzle, okay. An astral spell. Oh boy. Okay, that actually might help us a little bit if we want to use that. Alright, there's the indemnity. Perfect. Gonna use that. And I'm actually going to get rid of this so I, I have a chance here. Alright, so we're gonna pop this on. Um, and I think we're gonna hit very soon after. Because we already got some, some blades on. Let's see what this guy does. Ah, there it is. The mass, mass... Yep, there we go. Okay, so there we go. We're good. Critical. I think that's another frostbite. Not bad. I can take another frostbite. <laughs> Alright, what do we want to do here? How do we want to handle this? Uh, I'm thinking... Shatterhorn on this guy, maybe? Yes? No? I think we should. I think we're going to go ahead and use the Shadow Hern on this man right here. Yeah, let's do it. I think this should be okay. If we don't kill, well, then that's not great. But I think we should be okay. Oh, I love this spell. It's so cool. 
critical. Very nice. There's the intercepted damage. Oh boy, got an avalanche! <laughs> Ooh, oh, perfect, just enough! Oh, that was amazing. Uh oh. Poor guy. Another shield. All right. Now that we got all that in order, uh, we're about to get ourselves another shadow pip. Um, we we really we don't really need another, huh? You know what? I'm gonna convert just just for the heck of it, and um, I think that'll be the end of this fight here. I think we did pretty good. So I, I do understand now, it makes a lot more sense definitely to kill him first. It'll kind of prolong the battle if you don't, because he'll just resummon, you know, back himself. <laughs> so uh, I think we're going to go for a hit. I think we did a good job. Okay. I can't wait to see some of the rewards that we get. Because this is only the stone key boss. Keep that in mind as well. All right, pierce that a little bit. <laughs> Not too much. All right, and we're good. Bye-bye, Grendelin. All right, so we didn't get anything. <laughs> All right, well, that's okay. But that is the fight. Um, if you do the gold uh, key boss, obviously he's going to have a little bit more, you know, cards, a variety of cards, both of them, uh, both uh, King Boar and Grendelin. Uh, Grendelin, like I said, is an ice, so he's going to have a lot of defensive stuff. Um, you probably could try the Beguile, so if you get a death to use the Beguile so that you can negate that intercepted 75%, uh, I think you guys should definitely do that. But other than that, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video on the new Skeleton Key boss, uh, King Boar and Grendelin. And um, yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Do not forget to turn post notifications on. Uh, it'll notify you whenever I post a brand new video, which is perfect because there is uh, quite a lot that Test Drum has to offer. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in Test Drum. Have a nice day. Bye, guys.